Hi, I'm the Crazy Cricket Lady and I'm going to be showing you today how to combine mats to save not so much time but effort. This is how I have my paper on my mat. I measured each piece to make sure and noted where every piece was on the mat. Now I can cut all three of these colors at the same time by combining them together. In this video, we're going to teach you how to move things around a mat and how to move them from one mat to another. So, we're going to move this over here and rotate it. We're trying to make things fit onto little pieces of paper. So, if Design Space will cooperate with me, we're going to put the light blue here in this corner because that's where the light blue paper is on our mat. And then we're going to go to the yellow mat and we're going to move it to another mat. Okay. And we're going to put it on this mat. And as you can see, it transferred it to that mat. Now the yellow is up here in this corner. So we're going to put these pieces up here in this corner. And as you see, if it transfers to the mat, it changes it to the color of that mat. But that's not important because we have our paper where we want. You notice you cannot select the mat it's already on. It just protects you from doing that. Grab it. Turn it. Okay. Cooperate. Yay. Design space is now cooperating. I know where the, the colors are and I took all the measurements to make sure what size and what areas I needed to put them in. Now some warnings about this, you can do this, but if you cancel the make, it will put everything back on the right map, which is good and bad, but just know that if you cancel this, you're going to have to make it all over again. But all of this is ready to make and you just click continue. Another note on this, this setup of moving things from mat to mat, you cannot change the type of paper you use in the middle of this mat. So either make sure all your paper is the same type when you cut this or you're going to have problems. 